Deity Messages 101. So I'm just going to give you a couple simple uh, methods that you can do to uh, get messages from deities if you're not able to hear them audibly. Um, now, if you do have you if you do have an altar set up in your home dedicated to a certain deity, and you know you give offerings on it every day, um, you know it's decorated with stuff uh, that's associated with them, and you can actually feel their presence when when they're when you're in front of it. You know, it's their home. Um, all you gotta do is just walk up to it, walk up to the, the altar, uh, greet the deity, and go ahead and ask a question. Ask what it, you know, whatever you want, and be quiet and just stay there and just listen. Just listen. And you'll notice that your emotions will shift. If you ask them a question and they're angry, you will feel anger. Or you will feel, if, if they're pleased, you know, and they want to tell you that, you'll feel that. You'll just, your emotions will just shift as you stand in front. Um, and that's when you, you know, if you want to go ahead and talk to them that way, you can do that. Or what you can do is you can go ahead and get a spirit board, okay? And you can sit in front of the altar. Just put it down in front of the altar. Ask them a question. Just go ahead and ask them a question. Um, and if they want to go ahead and speak to you through that, the, you'll notice the planchette will just start moving. And then you can just go ahead and talk to the deity that way. Um, that's just a couple simple methods that I thought I'd throw out in getting messages from deities.